I got to get it more in a WNBA, man. I don't watch it. It's enough. a hell of a sport, dude. It is. It's really good. I make, my dad coaches fucking <laughs> girls basketball, and I make fun of him constantly. I'm like, girls basketball sucks. And he's like, well, they, you know what, Shane? They listen to coaches. That's what I like. I'm like, why can't you coach guys? Just coach guys, you fucking weirdo. What did he say? He's like, well, I'm fucking, I'd end up hitting them. <laughs> he's like, I'd fight them. Tell him be careful, dude. He like, might get he might get caught up, dude. It, probably. Yeah, if he made it this far, he probably won't. True. But now when you start to get in the geezer years, that's when you start to really just let loose and be like, That girl's hot. Fuck it. Yeah, I mean he that's might he might kid. be grandfathered into fucking like get out out there butt slaps the girls basketball. I don't think you can you can't do it. No butt slaps. Fuck no. Okay. If a volunteer high school coach <laughs> patted a girl on the butt <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. I told you about the basketball coach. The game would stop. Oh, dude, if the ref, he, if, the ref would see him If somebody saw it, the whole crowd would be like, whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. The ref would be like, time out, high five. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah, that's uh, – I had a guy come to recently I was talking to who just started, like, teaching in high school again. And uh, he was like – he started talking about – he's like, yeah, I don't know, man. I'm like, how's the gig? He's like, it's not bad. He was just like, I'm just trying not to stare at butts all day. And I was like, say what? And he was like, bro. Some I mean, girl. he's being honest. He's being honest, and I can appreciate it. But he, like, I was like, yeah, 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 it must be weird. He's like, no, nah, dude, you don't understand. I'm like, nah. all right, all right, this is where we need to fucking shift gears on this. Like, yeah. I get it. We can't talk about this. He's For like, real. He's like, I don't know who's a teacher and who's a student. That's the thing. He's like, some of these girls. I'm like, dude, okay. Like, yeah, you should probably definitely. tap out. Tap out of teaching. He's Go back like, to whatever the fuck you're like, doing. like, yo, I know you've been dying to tell someone this, and I, I look know. like the type of guy that would keep this secret. <laughs> I look like the oracle of this information, but, <laughs> but I'm like, yeah. bro, that's something I. It's. That is, I mean, at least the guy is being honest to be like, yo, they're so hot. But if you're like fucking all day long, like biting on a finger, like, God damn. It's like, all right, bro, go find another fucking job. Yeah, you can't work there. No. I couldn't. I specifically, my mom forever, my mom has this in my head that she wants me to be a teacher. And I'm like, I, I just, I couldn't be in high school, man. Like, I want, I'd go teach in like a prison or something. But yeah, I'd like. you fuck those guys. I'd fuck them. <laughs> but I, I don't, <laughs> I just can't, I wouldn't be able to be around 17 year old girls. Like, I, even on, like, a level of, like... Oh, you mean the hottest girls on the planet? 17, 18-year-old girls. <laughs> I would just bowing out of that, dude. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's like, nope, don't try... Like, dude, when I... I remember I talked about that Lyft driver I had who was super hot. Yeah, and I was wanted to suck on her fingers. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to suck her fingers, dude. That's all I could think about when she was, like, moving her hands. But, like, I made an explicit effort while we were driving to be like, I'm not going to steer the conversation at all towards, like, whatever that is that people do, like, dudes do to talk to girls at, like... That's geared towards yes. fucking them. I made it, and it was an effort the whole time. And then still, I, I think I said it when she dropped me off. There was a house next to mine. With the, it was a boarded up house next to another house, and then my house, which you know it looked nice. But she went a little too far, and the whole time I'd done so good. And I was like, "Oh, no, I'm, I'm right. That's my house right there." And I was Mine's like, a nice one. I just couldn't let this chick believe I lived next to a boarded up house. And you put me in, and that's just like, you know, there's a shit going beneath the surface all day and you're you're like these girls come to you with problems and you're like trying to be respectful and you don't even think on a subconscious level you might be getting a little weird. I had a guy Yeah, you definitely get weird. I had a dude tell me this, dude. He was it was a guy who uh does like guidance counseling. He was just like I just wasn't treating girls the same as I would treat the guys. Like the girls would come in with the same disciplinary shit and I'm like, Ah, you're all right, da, 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 da. and he's like he was honest, this was a different guy. He was like, Maybe I'm attracted to them and dude, the people in the seminar thing were like Yo, bro. And I was sitting there just like, bro, chill, yeah, bro, chill. Yeah, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. <laughs> shut up. But yeah, for sure. Dude. Shut up, bro. You're getting me hard, dude. Sure, you're dude. getting me hard, dude. You're for getting me hard, dude. <laughs> Yo, and they also get sucked into being like, oh, she's so cool. Like, yeah, they get man. sucked into like the hierarchy of like, of, like the popular yeah, girl. Of, like, oh, Stacy's so fucking cool, dude. Oh, I'd love dude, for her to talk so to me. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny thinking about like a 45 year old guidance counselor walking, watching girls walk through the hall, like, there she yeah. goes. And then like the quarterback comes through and he's like, Brad's so fucking cool. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, he just finds Lord. himself naked in the shower with the football team. Like, how did I get here, dude? <laughs> What's up, guys? How you doing? Dude, that good must, lift. I yeah. can't even imagine. Look, man, I like I said, I'm tapping. Maybe when I'm 60, I could do something like that. Yeah. My T's still too high, dude. Also, That's what the thing also of low T, people dude. will listen to this and be like, I can't even imagine being a guy that would be like, that would look down upon someone being like, dude, high school chicks are hot as fuck. Like, there's no way I could work there. Oh, no, exactly. If you're like, it's fucked up, it's like. Do you, low T? Go ahead. You know, <laughs> it's like, bro. If go I had ahead, your, low T. if I had your little balls, I could go do it too. But mine are fucking working double time, dude. I fucking, I, I can't help the fact that what's hot is hot to me. 
I have so much tea. I'd see some of those teenage boys and be like, I'm fucked up, dude. dude there's <laughs> hot boys running around. I have the balls of like a Roman senator, dude. I was like. <laughs> <laughs> Bring him to me. <laughs> Charles, Place I'd like to see you after class. <laughs> Place cock in ass. Dude, how <laughs> many smart kids? No. This guy's like fucking his body slave and he has male body slaves and he's trying to fuck this lady and he's like Bolsinovus, place cock in ass. And this guy says like slaves like Jesus Christ comes yeah. fucking him in the ass. He's like, come oh. on. <laughs> Dude, imagine yeah, that's can't even go back to the times when your porn was the people you owned. You're like, I wonder what the por- happened in the porn world today. And you're like, oh, yeah, I'm the executive producer and star of this show. And you're like, let's go, baby. We're doing this and that. It's fucking wild, dude. Imagine how many of those teachers jerk off to after-school porn. You know what I mean? Like, oh, when my it, God. If I, dude, if I was a teacher, oh. I would be jerking off to teacher porn all day. Dude, my thing is that, so you have these Roman senators were getting, like, place <laughs> cock in ass. And then we've just evolved from them. So you don't think we got a little fucking... They think that we're like, nah, dude, we're totally much, like, no, we put a better, we had the fucking, the cork more firmly in the bottle, but dude, deep down on some level, when the fucking pretty girl raises her hand, you're like, uh, uh, yes, Lindsay, yes, yes, okay. yes Lindsay. It, Karen, like, shut up. <laughs> Karen, you're always talking, shut up, I hate you, you're so fat and ugly. <laughs> Stacy, go. <laughs> oh, good lord, I went to Catholic school too, it was fucking, oh my those god, uniforms, dude, dude. I would so die, hot. I would die. And oh. then, all right, so here's another fucking horrendous thought. This is all, at least we'll definitely never have a teaching career after this. Sure. For sure, I'll never be okay. a teacher after this episode. <laughs> <laughs> but, so you're a, you're a 25-year-old high school teacher. Yeah. You see you see some hot? You can tell a freshman's going to be hot someday. For sure. She's bordering. For sure. Sophomore year, she's getting a little hotter. She comes back junior, senior year, full oh, fucking my tits. God, dude. Think of that summer tit progression. Where, like, the last time you saw her, then the next time you see her, she's got giant tits. You're like, hey, hey, you, you developed. <laughs> oh, my God. I mean, you're, as a dude, you're going to be nervous around fat titties no matter where they are, who has them. So, like, all of a sudden, it's, you're like... You know, help me out in hours after the lab. And all of a sudden, she has fat titties the next year. And you're like, we can't be alone together anymore. I just need you to understand <laughs> Legally, this. we can't close this door. Yeah, like open all the windows, <laughs> open the door, full tripod. And was oh. like, yeah, Those man. Those guys are saints now that I think about it. God bless them, dude. Or are they fucking dudes figured to be living above Waffle House, dude? <laughs> 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 are they saints? Or are they just like, I don't know. I just, something always called me to be a teacher and work with like teens and stuff. I don't know what it is. It's like, I'm not saying. I mean, it. yeah, dude, everybody has that vocation. Yeah, I got, dude. I'm called to that now, dude. I wish I was working with teens. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, dude, you just gotta be careful not to find yourself on fucking perv air, dude. You're chained next to Lily. <laughs> chained next to Lily. That's the con air is just fucking all high school teachers, Louie, Cosby. Yeah, Louie's like, we Fogel. gotta, we gotta get out of here. <laughs> it's amazing. I'm in a seat and I'm just flying through the sky. It's amazing. <laughs> God damn. You gotta go, don't you? Yeah. All right, we ripped her. All right, dog. We tore her open and ripped her. We fucking ripped open this team. <laughs> <laughs> we got down. We made it through the election and got to the important shit. Dude, we this got through the... all the political dumb bullshit. We got to how hot high school kids are. I mean, Dude, imagine being a science teacher in a lab. Big titted fucking kid comes in and be like, can you? T-? The whole time I'd be staring at that fucking those buttons. Just be like, I would rip those apart. You know when a girl's wearing a dress and like she moves a certain way and you see the shape of her ass against the dress and you're like, oh, she's got some ass in there. The girl's fucking beaker, mm. beaker spills out of control and she grips a beaker, two hand oh. grips it. You <laughs> pop behind her like, Stacy, back away. <laughs> Wait, actually, hold on. Uh, move. Oh, dude. dude that's or, why those fucking nuns. Or they're nuns. teasing you and they're like sending you the... Dude. They I, definitely would tease you. Yes. They know. Yeah, dude. And you're you're the fucking authority figure. Those fucking teens would love to fuck you. Yeah, or like you're like yeah you're yeah. the you're the hot cool <laughs> young you're like Mister Hunter dude in there and you're like another cool thing about books and they're like oh my god he's so smart. <sighs> then some kid comes at you come after class and you're like, I let Billy Sumter hump me behind the hat in my house and you're like oh okay. What <laughs> yeah, up? Yeah. I mean, how long did he last? I'm just saying. A lot of kids, a lot of kids pop quick. A lot of kids, a lot of these kids pop pretty quick. It'd be interesting because a lot of lovers you have right now aren't really technically the best, but, you know, an older man. Once you mature. 
Oh my god! Dude. Or they're like, Billy broke up with me behind the reason. You're like, you don't know how beautiful you are. Because you need a man. <laughs> One day you'll have a man that'll cherish you for the beautiful woman that you are. I'm also going through a divorce right now. <laughs> it's funny, my wife will not want to have sex with me either. They kind of relate. I shouldn't be telling you this, but... <laughs> I shouldn't be in the guidance council room right now. I trust you. <laughs> <laughs> you and me have something special, Stacy. You can text me anytime you want. Oh, my God. How does this outfit look? And you're just like... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You can't... You can't... Uh... Again, it goes back to my – I'm more, that's my whole thing with politics, and this is what I was trying to explain to my mom. I'm not into the veneer of politics and, like, how people put themselves off to be. I'm into the animal instincts that drive people against the, – they, they don't even want to acknowledge. I'm into that stuff. So I, you can't – I don't care about voting, dude. Yeah. I like to watch people and look around and see what's really going on. Cause I was like, – I did teach at a, a kid's school, though, and you? had zero, zero issue at all. Like, so much so that one of the kids, when I was leaving Spain, mm -hmm. gave me her email address – and was like, we can FaceTime. Mm -hmm. It was like a third or fourth grader. That's totally different, And I was bro. like, yeah, of course. Like totally I, didn't, I didn't even think about it. And another teacher came up to me and was like, yo, what the fuck are you doing, dude? Don't take someone's fucking info like that, you weirdo. <laughs> that's not that third. That's the thing. That's not your Jones, dude. Oh, of if, course, of course. I can't, I can't even 17-year-old was FaceTiming me, dude, like, be like, hey, how you doing? I'd be like. I'm eh. just alone right now. Uh, I'm nothing. I just like just pop up from doing push-ups. I know she's about to call. I'm like, oh, nothing much. She's fucking. What's going on? How's college going? You know, I heard you're a senior this year. How's the transition from freshman year of college? Oh, yeah, man. That'd wow. be another thing too. Running into your ex students. Nineteen. Stacy doesn't go to college. She buzzes around town. Yeah. Dates a fucking pill she dealer. She works at the Waffle House. That's Dates. why that guy's living upstairs. Yeah. <laughs> that was, that was <laughs> Stacy's lab teacher. <laughs> He's upstairs watching her. I day. always love you, Stacy. Ever since the fifth grade, <laughs> you got a spot for me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, dude! I never even thought about the like a teacher watching a girl develop. From freshman to senior year, that's so disgusting. That's so gross, dude. Oh my god! Especially like the health teacher who like has to think about like sex and physio, physio like oh. uh, physiognomy, and he's just like, and then he's telling freshman he eventually sees him get hot, and he's just like, "Can we talk about sex again? Can oh. I give you guys a talk, dude? Imagine dude. the guy talking to kids about sex. We had a girl. We had a lady. We had a lady too, and we know how that went. Yep. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. She was texting people. Yeah, I shouldn't have said that. She, was, hey, but uh, air her out, dude. She's nah, a fuck that. No, she's a she's uh, a good girl. She's a, that's a fine line when it's when the sexes flip. It's is it predator or dream weaver? Dream weaver. <laughs> dream yeah. weaver. That's why nuns went around Catholic school and were fucking measuring skirt lengths. You know what I mean? They're like, pull your fucking skirt down. Dude. You have no idea. You have no idea what you're doing to these guys. <laughs> That's true. You have no idea. Everyone's <laughs> like, these teachers are trying to control us. It's like, nah, dude, they're trying to save you from an <laughs> almost guaranteed rape. <laughs> Don't fucking lift that skirt up. That's like, dude, in public schools where girls can dress however they want. Yeah. Whew. Oh, dude, it's crazy. And you can't be like, uh, don't wear that. Because it's like, like what, what, do you have a problem with it, you weirdo? Well, there are like immodesty rules, but now with like, you know. The more widely accepted things of feminism now, yeah, a girl, like girl girls can be like, stop slut shaming. Yeah, exactly. Imagine so, working in high school and girls don't wear bra, bras. Letter of resignation, dude. It's for day one. Day I, one. I'd be like, Prince. Prince. Taking hand in my gun in my badge right away. Prince Paul, dude. I can't talk about rocks and shit anymore to these hot ass yeah, kids. I can't dude. try to explain volcanoes to these, <laughs> these incredibly hot kids, dude. With I titties. Am out. If I see titties, my eyes can catch that from like 50 feet away. If I see like titties popping out of a t shirt, I'm like, man. Eh. I can't do that. I was laughing the other day about how, like, even with, like, young kid pop stars and, like, that that's definitely – that's a form of, like, ritual sacrifice. We take a hot young girl and just give all her the attention to her and just watch them slowly lose their minds. Yeah, it's awesome. And we're like, next, Ariana Grande, get on. You're on. You're on. Next. Like, oh, Thank she's, you. Oh, she's so fucking hot. Oh, she broke up. Oh, her boyfriend died. She's done. Who's next? Uh, it's <laughs> fucking sick, dude. <laughs> yeah. I mean uh, – I don't know if this is a good episode for us to release. This is great. It is hilarious. This dude. is great. It is hilarious. And like I was watching, uh, I told you when I watched Sicario 2, there's like a hot kid in it. Really? The girl, there's like a girl that gets kidnapped. She's like a cartel leader's daughter. And she's super hot. She's like fucking like 16 or 15 when they filmed it. Goddamn. Dude, it's insane. Yeah. That's fucking wild. 
That's I'm telling you, man. It's like there's hot kids among us, dude, and you got to fight to think get about, off that plane, dude. You can't get on that plane. Brittany, Christina Aguilera, all those guys. Think about that gatekeeper process they went through. Dudes being like, "I'll back that." Some girls like, "Dim, dim, dim." You're like, "Yeah, I'll back that. That sounds good." And fucking, it's pretty sick. Yeah. Same with fucking little boy bands, dude. You don't think they paid the fucking piper? Someone passing <laughs> hey, they through. They paid that toll, dude. <laughs> yeah, dude. There's some bridge trolls, dude. <laughs> they had to fucking cross those bridges. There's some hot boy bands, too. Yeah, man. If you're into boys, that's a hot bunch of boys. Yeah. Think about managing one of those. But I'm going to dress you up like this. You're going to wear this. You're going to wear that. I'll pay you 50 bucks and let me blow you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's do it. Yeah, you want to wrap this Let's one up? Let's get out of here, dude. Yeah, this is... Let's get out of this wormhole. <laughs> <laughs> Eventually, the only way this goes is one of us says something too far. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm Go sorry ahead, to cut ahead, you off. Go We're ahead. going on your mother-in-law's Go TV in a second. But it just yeah. rem- that's just like... It reminds me of, like, geezer talk. Like, my dad will just guess names. <laughs> just, he, he doesn't know your name. He still can't figure out your name. It's like, Bring you're still up. down Bring there up with that Chris McCusker. <laughs> <laughs> McCluskey, uh, but I was I was on the phone with him today, and he was talking about his his basketball team lost first round in the <gasps> state playoffs. They scored four points at oh. half. <laughs> at halftime, it was thirteen to four at half. That stings. He was like, we held them to I think three points in the second half and got outscored. Oh, <laughs> yeah, so they had ice hockey numbers. Yeah. But he finally reversed. He finally had a good reverse on me because I always make fun of him. I'm like, dude, I would drop 50 on your shitty team. Yeah. I would destroy your team. You definitely would. So I was like, Dad, I, uh, he, they, the other team had this girl that was 6'3 that just fucked them up. Oh. And I was like, dude, I'm 6'3. I would murder your team. <laughs> He's like, Shane, you got a weird fantasy about playing with high school girls. <laughs> you need to focus on the road. Because I was driving. <laughs> He's like, see ya. And hung up. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I was like, Dave, you finally reversed it. Because normally, I, yeah, I just call him a pervert the whole time <laughs> for being around girls' high school basketball. Does he know who Bucky Gills is? I don't know. Probably. Give him, send him a Bucky Gills article. Who's that? Bucky Gills. I used to go to his basketball camp. He was the guy who allegedly squirted shampoo on his girls' basketball team in the shower. Yeah. Oh, so they were they were naked in the shower, and he came in and was. I think he was he was horsing around. He was like, "Ladies, great playing out there." Maybe it was like a champagne over the shoulder thing. <laughs> hit some with, hit him with some pert plus. That was the that was the alleged thing that he was being indecent, <laughs> really indecent. I dude. think there might have been, I, you know, don't quote me. I think there might have been butt slaps. Like, get out there, like, smack on the butt. All right, that's that that's makes forgivable. Sense. That's sports, but yeah, a little celebratory squirt of pert plus while they're in the shower, coming in and spraying them. That's what people were saying. Soaping them up. That's what people were saying, dude. You are soaping them up. You can't soap up the squad, dude. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know, I've been so afraid of my dad fucking soaping up the squad. Oh my god, <laughs> it would be so embarrassing, dude. <laughs> you should send him an article and be like, "Dude, let it Why be a be, cautionary tale." Yeah, dude, that's that's Icarus. <laughs> that's Icarus, dude. Drake is Icarus. Oh, he's dude. flying way too close to the sun right Gibson now. Gibson came out against it. 